My faith has changed a lot over the past few years, and it's something that I don't talk about with basically anyone because it's something that is very personal to me. And at this point in my spiritual journey, I'm trying to figure out what I believe and why I believe it instead of just listening to what other people are telling me to believe like I did for many, many years. And I don't want to talk about how my specific beliefs have changed, but I do want to talk a little bit about how my spiritual practice has changed because similar to how I spent the majority of my life convinced that I was not creative because in the art classes at my public schools they taught things like drawing and painting and I was never good at drawing or painting so I must not be creative, right? No, I have come to realize that I am very, very creative and that there are a million and one ways to be creative. And similarly, there are a million and one ways to practice your faith. There are a million and one ways to connect with God. It doesn't have to be within the walls of a religious center or in the presence of a pastor. My yoga practice is a very spiritual practice to me. My morning routine is a very spiritual practice to me because during that time of the day, I am very present and I invite the Lord to be a part of that time of my day. And that's what my faith has become. It's become about my personal relationship with God. It's become about taking intentional time to be with God and open myself up to receive whatever it is that the Lord wants to put on my heart that day. And whatever you believe, whether or not you believe in any higher power, I think it's important for us all to continue to open our minds up to different ways of life, different ways of living. We don't have to pigeonhole ourselves to think that there is only one right way to live our life because there's not. There are as many ways to live life as there are living organisms on this earth. So keep doing you.